I'm going to be reading the title. So. What are you doing, Ruby? Making another one. Okay. Just don't come this way, okay? Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. First comes out with some stickers. It's in Spanish and English. Yes. So. What is it? Let's get the camera closer. I'm just on my screen. Uh, yeah. Just pull this out. Nice and out. Okay, that's right. Sorry for the mess right here. My sister works on here. I've been drawing to <gasps> No! Oh, Jesus. Okay, I got everything nice and organized. Just gotta grab something real quick. Our little bud. He keeps me company while well, he's going to sit there. Good morning, Casita, Maribel says. When she wakes up, the sun and the breeze felt like the room. Happiness, Maribel, quickly gets ready. It's... It's a very special day in the magic encanto where she lives. Mirabel's cousin Antonio is turning five today. He'll soon receive a magic gift. Mirabel jumps and dances. Casita does too. There is no time to waste. There's a lot to do. Everyone's wondering what Antonio's special gift will be, even Casita. Abby, did, you, did Mom come and wash clothes? Uh -huh. Okay, can we get ready to go sleep? Yeah, I'm just reading. So, that's because I gotta just like move a lot these days. Maybe it will be. Like his mama's gift. Peppa dances with her husband, Felix. She is happy and the sun shines brighter. But when she gets mad, rain and thunder arrive. Her gift that is the weather changes with her emotions. Sorry, I'm just going crazy. Let's be quiet, Mirabel tells Casita. Mirabel's cousin Dolores can hear anything, everything in the Akanto. Her gift is powerful hearing. She hears music, wind, and footsteps, and sometimes things she's not supposed to hear. Well, that's crazy. Mirabel and Casita are preparing the family table and Marjorie Gulls will join uncles, aunts, cousins, of, and of course, Abuela Alema. Abuela Alema. Abuela Alema. I'm gonna have to hold this, guys. I went up. I remember. But all one uncle, Bruno, his gift is the ability to tell the future. But everyone in Encanto gets scared. Then he uses his power because it seems to bring only bad news. Where could he be? Mirabel wonders. Here's the picture.
dance with me, Casita, says Mirabel. She sings and plays her accordion that hangs from the strong tree on the Casita's back panel. The but the tree isn't as strong as Louisa. Mirabel's sister can lift a church, three donkeys, and a whole wagon all at the same time. Camilo is Mirabel's cousin. That's good. Yeah, it's fine. Is Mirabel's cousin. It's just gonna be a little bit late. Let's just put a little bit in. Never mind. Mirabel's cousin Camilo. He has the interesting gift. He can shape shift to look like anyone. Camilo can be a little troublemaker. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes, sometimes Mirabel feels sad. She doesn't think she is special on her gift day. She didn't get a magical power. If only her mother could cure her sadness with her delicious upper Julia's gift is the ability to heal with her food. Almost done. Awela Arama watches her family decorate Casita for Antonio's celebration. The magical candle is in our hands. What will his gift be? This is good for falling asleep. I'm getting tired. Almost done. Antonio waits quietly by his door. Suddenly, a approaches him and come with with a jaguar. And youngest member of the family is received his gift. He can communicate with animals. Oh. The whole community celebrates the magical of the canto. What a happy day. Last page. Good night, Casita Mirabel. It's ready to sleep and dream. Music, flowers, trees, and the gift that one day she hopes to receive. Tomorrow, a new adventure awaits in the wonderful encounter. Then stickers. Good night, everyone. That's the last of it. And I hope I see you tomorrow. Bye.